What's up guys, it's Kazoo here and welcome to episode 16 of Skin Into Glory and uh, before we're going to be starting off I just wanted to let you guys know that I qualified myself for FUD Champions uh, Weekend League on my main account So um, yeah, I really want to make a video on it but not too sure what to do since you obviously have to play 40 games So let me know in the comments down below what you guys want to see exactly and uh, I'll try to make a video on it very very soon Anyway, we're going to be starting off going in what will be the first game and we're going against a ridiculous team players wise He had Boateng Vidal, Griezmann, uh, Quadrado as well, Ribéry, some great players. Chemistry wise it was kind of lacking but um, he had some amazing players in his side and uh, they definitely showed up for him in the first kind of half of the game. You can see right there he did get some big chances but the finishing wasn't really that great especially with that first chance um, he had with Marquisio which he completely skied. So uh, yeah 26 minutes we got our first chance as well a shot from distance which the goalkeeper saved. Then uh, we continue on creating more chances with Parotti here. Great scoop turn plays it on through to Allen who actually slots it home and makes it 1-0 in our advantage. A nice goal there to uh, start off for us. Then uh, still in the first half, 38th minute, he has the ball in with Griezmann, turns around, plays it on through to James Rodriguez, the goalkeeper saves, and then from the rebound, it's actually Griezmann who wins the header compared to, I think, Rudiger, and um, he makes it 1-1. So um, yeah, a goal which I hope that the goalkeeper saved, but it did go in. Annoying to see, uh, see a goal like that one go in, especially since I thought the goalkeeper could have saved it. The 40th minute, he brought his goalkeeper, kind of messed up that chance as well. I probably should have uh, should have chipped him, I think. The 45th minute, some great stuff here from Douglas Costa. I wanted to pass it off to Allen, but I kind of passed it to myself. We did get a chance there with Parotti. We turn around, we shoot, this time it went wide. And that is how the first half ended. So, um, yeah, went back and forth a bit. We did create a couple chances. So did my opponent. And, um, yeah, going into the second half with a draw. We started off straight from kickoff, getting a chance here. Uh, we picked the ball up here with a left back. Wendell plays it on through to Muriel. Plays it on through here to Douglas Costa. Cuts in with the scoop turn. And then a great finish into the back of the net, making it 2-1 and giving us the lead back in this game. Then uh, we jump all the way to the 89th minute where it is Quadrado on the right-hand side. It was a really, really boring second half. I tried to kind of mix it up a bit, go with some skill moves at the end, but didn't really get a chance out of it. The 90th minute, he crossed it in. I think he hit the crossbar. The goalkeeper did get a touch on it, but uh, it was enough to uh, not let in a goal. And that is also how the game ended. So we ended up winning the game 2-1, to one, uh, pick up another three points. They we're actually very, very close, uh, clinching the division title in Division 5. So uh, that is definitely the aim for this episode. So I decided to switch teams back to the other team, and uh, we go what will be the second game of the episode. And we comp against a uh, La Liga side in the 4-2-3-1 formation with inform Sergio Roberto as his right back. And uh, we started things off in the second minute. My opponent gets himself the first chance with Orellana. I don't know what Mangala did there, but a brilliant save there from either my goalkeeper or my defender. I'm not too sure what it was, but uh, it didn't go in. Then at eighth minute, we go through it with Ben Yedder. The goalkeeper came out, but I went for the chip shot, which powerful-wise wasn't really that great. I think I just should have added a little bit more power to it, and it probably would have gone in. 32nd minute, we have Carrillo on the right-hand side, and he had two players marking me, and it was really, really difficult to actually, like, get past him. But then he messed up here with Farhan. We do get a Beku shot in here with Ben Yedder. I think it was the only option to, like, get a proper shot in, and, um, yeah, the goalkeeper saved it really, really nicely. Then 44th minute, plays it on through here to Gamero, who was completely free, and he makes it 1-0 just before half-time, so a uh, really annoying way to concede a goal. Then a 60th minute into the second half we go. Player on through here to Mosonda. Really weird ball. And the goalkeeper decided to come out as well. We did beat it with the burpee spin. He went with a slide tackle. He tried to cross it in to like get ahead or some sort of on goal. Then we get sort of a bicycle quick in with Ben Yedder. Didn't really get the didn't really get like a proper shot in, unfortunately. And um, yeah, the chance was kind of wasted. Then now uh, we continue on 73rd minute. Douglas Costa goes through it. Again, his goalkeeper came out. And this time we go with a perfectly timed chip over the goalkeeper. And he went in. You can see from the replay as the defender tried to like uh, clear off the line. But uh, luckily enough, it did go in. Then a few minutes later, we picked up a free kick. Again, Douglas Costa steps up for it, just like in the previous episodes. And it went in a really nice goal to get the second of this game. But it actually ended up being an own goal because the player he decided to put on the line, uh, Jimenez, actually kicked it in his own net. So, um, yeah, it was cool to see. Unfortunately, though, we uh, we didn't get the second goal because you can see right here, 80 minute, we go through here again with Douglas Costa to actually complete his hat-trick. Unfortunately, though, it ended up being not like his his real hat-trick, but um, I still kind of see it as a hat-trick, though, because uh, he played amazing. He, again, uh, played a big part in our, in our victory in this game as well. So, um, yeah, I think we only need two more points in order to win the title. So next game, if we win that one, 
we do win a title, which is definitely something I want to accomplish in this episode. So, um, yeah, going on what will be the final game of the episode. Uh, come against a uh, league unside in the 4-3-3 formation with some uh, great players in the side. Matuidi, Jesse Rodriguez and also Cavani, of course. So, um, yeah, we started things off in almost uh, the second half already. The 38th minute, Fiatto here on the ball goes through. Two of the defenders uh, running towards him. We did get a shot in, though. Just went wide and that was pretty much it for the first half. My opponent did get himself a chance here as well, an extra time with Jesse Rodriguez. But uh, yeah, I think it got deflected by one of his own attackers. So yeah, not really a great shot on target. They're going into the second half. He starts off here with a shot from uh, Cavani, I think. A good save for my goalkeeper, uh, Diego Alves. Then from a free kick, I gave him the ball back and then he played it on through here to Cavani. I thought this was going to be a goal. But again, Diego Alves there with a really, really important save. Then jumping on to the, to the 90th minute already, it was pretty much the first kind of huge chance we had in the game. It is Musonda here going through, plays it on through here to our striker, Ben Yedder, But we actually do pick it up with Carrillo, who goes through inside the box. I want to go with the fake Rabona, then with a sombrero flick. And we didn't even have the time to pull off the sombrero flick because we get fouled from behind. I hope that the goalkeeper actually uh, would be a send-off. But the referee decided not to give any cards or something. So, um, yeah, we got a penalty in the 90th minute. Like, it was so important to actually get this win. So we step up for it with Ben Yedder. We take the penalty and it actually went in top corner. The goalkeeper was really, really close. But, um, yeah, we managed to, uh, to seal the victory in the 90th minute in, in the dying seconds again. So, um, yeah, I was really happy with that win. You can see stats-wise, my uh, opponent was all over me possession-wise and also just chances-wise. But we still won the game. So, um, yeah, a great way uh, to, uh, to actually win the title in Division 5. So, um, yeah, for the next episode, we're going to be uh, playing some games in Division 4. Hopefully you guys are looking forward to it because I definitely am. Really want to really wanna reach Division 1 as soon as possible. But anyway, guys, that's going to be the end. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, then make sure to leave a like. It would be very much appreciated. So thank you very much for watching, and I will see you guys later. Bye-bye.